Hi my lovelies, welcome back to my channel and for everybody who is new, I'm Leora and I'm so glad you found me. So welcome to this video which is going to be a collaboration video with Rapunzel who is supplying all the scarves and everything that is wrapping related that you will see here today. And I am actually uh, super special excited today because as I have told you already I think in the last wrapping tutorial that I did in collaboration with Rapunzel that this is actually the month where we have our anniversary, our collaboration anniversary. So uh, happy anniversary Rapunzel and me <laughs> because this is really uh, such a blessing I think for both of us and I just hope and pray that one day we're going to be able to meet and I'll be able to just lock myself in the Rapunzel warehouse and just uh, play for one night. <laughs> So that would be amazing and um, I should do a vlog video about that because that would be so cool. Just trying out different stuff and just going crazy with all the different combinations. Um, I think if I ever get to America again then, <laughs> then we should plan that. Anyway, so that is that and today we're going to do a special wrap. It is special because it is so simple and it is so sophisticated and I have actually been asked to do also more simple wraps because there are a lot of people here that are new to wrapping and that all these um, elaborate looks are like way too advanced and so I think today we're going to tone it down a little bit and we're just going to do sort of a spin-off of the regal wrap and I'll show you different color combinations and things like this. So I think that's what we're going to do today. Plus, <laughs> I want to point out that the uh, Chagim line, which is the festival fall line of scarves, have just dropped on the Rapunzel website. So if you want to go ahead and check that out, it's really, really beautiful. They're very, very nice things there. I just checked it out last night and I was like, wow. <laughs> okay, so uh, if you want, go, ahead, go to the website and check it out. And besides that, we're just going to go right into the tutorial. Okay, so the look that I'm going for today is what I'm calling the double regal wrap. And I've actually been asked how I'm doing this. Uh, and I thought, wow, this is so easy. Like, you know, why do I, sh why should I make a tutorial on this? But uh, people asked me, so I'm going to do this. And also, uh, first of all, we're going to build it up and we're going to do a normal regal wrap, first of all. And I'm, for that, I'm going to use a soft pashmina. So this is actually not from Rapunzel because I don't have a color like this from Rapunzel. But if you you go on the Rapunzel website and look up soft pashmina you will find a brown one like this right there it's the same thing so I'm gonna link that in the description box as a pashmina from Rapunzel because it is really the same thing okay so let's just put it down over the shaper and I'm wearing the Wendy shaper as usual because it's my my favorite of all times let me just go to like turn to the side a little bit and I'm going to wrap this behind my head Cross it over and then I'm just going to uh, put this this part here under my arm to hold it tight because I'm not going to have a knot in the back and then I'm using this this tightness sort of and uh, pull this side a little bit um, straight <laughs> and then I'm just going to flip it over let me just adjust my mirror a little bit okay so and then I'm tucking this away wherever it fits so depending on which shaper you have you will have different spots where you're gonna uh, be tucking it away but for me it just fits the way that it ended up here if you have a smaller shaper you might be bringing it around more and then tucking it away here and then I'm releasing the other side and then I'm just bringing the other side over, also straightening it out a little bit. And I always feel that, especially with those soft pashminas, they are such a hidden gem, really, because they are sort of like the two-in-ones, um, but amplified, you know? And I think that is such a useful tool for wrapping, especially when you like to go uh, for combination looks with other scarves, that they, they are so, amazing because they are simple they are easy to wrap and they provide the perfect canvas for whatever else you want to put on top of that okay so by the way i'm also wearing a sari scarf around here because i just think it is really really nice and i'm using my scarves also like as belts and as as wraps like this and you know whatever so you can just totally go crazy and do all kinds of things like scarves are not just for the head obviously okay so this is what i would consider a normal 
normal regal wrap and um, by tugging it in here it's sort of created by itself a nice little pattern which is really really cute and you could quite frankly just leave it like that so that is the normal regal wrap and what I then like to do especially when as a first scarf I don't have any kind of pashmina but a two-in-one which is much much thinner and does not uh, give a lot of volume and as you know I love volume so that's actually how I started to do that because I wanted to have more volume so then I'm just taking another scarf and in this case here this is the peaceful morning scarf in silver milk chocolate it's really really beautiful and it is surprisingly like this is not my color scheme obviously but I thought to do a monochromatic wrap which we're doing today can be so super elegant and um, I think it will speak to a lot of people in my audience who are maybe not super crazy about color you know okay so anyway I'm folding this up in either thirds or four fourths something like that quarters I don't know how to say that I'm, I'm folding it nicely and then I'm just putting it down here with both ends hanging down equally like this so um, this does not have to be super super straight or, or organized uh, if you ask me I think it is super charming and it sort of adds something if it is not a hundred percent flat <laughs> you know what I mean and then again I'm tucking on both sides so it is nice and tight and I'm tucking away one side of the of the scarf and applying sort of a little bit of pressure while laying it down right above my shaper and I'm tucking it away here okay and then I'm doing exactly the same again with the other side so depending on again uh, which shaper you're using it it then comes out differently because you always have different places to tuck in which always creates an a, a own pattern of its own yeah <laughs> something like that okay then of course if you want you can add a headband like this which is the vintage beauty headband I'm I don't want to do that because I have to take my, off my shaper in order to put it on but this is then how it would look for example if you would add a headband which is really really pretty like that and um, and then I, I think I'm just gonna do the same wrap but I'm gonna use a sari scarf instead of the uh, peaceful morning scarf because this is now the monochromatic version and I think I also want to just show you how it looks different with um, if you put a different color on your basic pashmina on your solid or soft pashmina whatever you want to call it okay so that's what we're gonna do now and that's gonna be the second part of the tutorial Okay, my lovely. so we are back to that stage where we have put on the soft pashmina in a simple regal wrap and now instead of the peaceful morning scarf, I'm just going to take a colorful scarf and then you can of course play with the colors and use whatever you want. I'm going for the traditional neutral with a pop of color, which I also did with my eyes today, so I thought they would be cute. And I'm just going to put that down like this with both ends hanging down equ equally. And then we're just going to cross it over in the back and then again apply this this kind of a pressure tugging it tight and lying it down and now when you have a scarf like a sari scarf which is a, a must <laughs> a must have then of course every wrap that you wrap exactly the same it turns out differently because it always layers differently sari scarves are just so versatile it's amazing so there you will always have a different color scheme playing out like that you know so this is then the next version of the um double regal wrap sort of you know um, and I think this is super super beautiful and it is so simple but it adds so much elegance the the regal wrap I think is in general very underestimated and don't think that I ever that, that, I, that I don't do regal wraps when I'm off camera and I have my no makeup days and I don't have any photo shoots and I don't have to come up with something that is like special and inspiring for other people I just do a regal wrap you know because it's beautiful it's simple 
simple, it's like no nonsense kind of purity that I really, really like and I crave it a lot, you know? So I, I love that because there are no distractions and it's just simple elegance and I, you know, I love that very, very much. So this is how that looks. And of course, if you then have a, a sari scarf, you can then um, play with that and do like little spin-offs instead of tucking it away neatly, you just tuck it in a little bit and let those ends, fringy ends hanging out. And then immediately you have like a cute little detail that adds to the look if you want that, you know? So yeah, and also here you can of course add the headband if you want that like this so yeah so that is that and i hope for all the beginners out there i hope that was was helpful to you because i do feel that a rigo wrap is the perfect startup point you know for people who like to wrap and like to go for a turban look um because it is simple it is not it doesn't interfere with anything nothing hanging down nothing distracting and it is really rather simple to wrap and it has a very very nice look coming out of that considering how simple it is and then again you can add on other scarves you can also layer a third scarf on this and have like three colors showing up or doing a crisp cross pattern and that is then all things that you can learn uh, what as you go along uh, yeah and that, that is the look so I hope you enjoyed that I hope it is, is helpful and I hope that everybody who is more in advanced will understand that I also do some simple looks for for the new ladies here because they deserve some love too right <laughs> So that's what we did today. I hope you liked the video and if you did so then please give the video a like and if you're new here then please subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Rapunzel's channel and um, don't forget that I have a code with Rapunzel. It gives you 5% off to your order. It is uh, affiliated so if you want to support me like that then I'll be happy <laughs> you, you do <laughs> and I'll be honored if you do and uh, yeah besides that just come back for my next video which is going to be either my next wrapping tutorial or or my next video of all my other content and up until then go ahead and sparkle hugs and kisses bye